Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to do a palette bingo on my The W7 Lives at Beach Metallic Beach Shimmers Eye Color Palette. It is this one right here. If you haven't seen a palette bingo before, it is basically where you choose a palette. You go to uh, some sort of randomizer thing. I went to random.org because that is what I know and I think it is easy to use. And then you choose four to five shades depending on what you feel like and kind of what palette you have as, as well. Um, so yeah, this palette is looking like this. So it is a beautiful color story and is very much reminding of the packaging, so I think it's nice. So if you want to see how I got this look that I am wearing, please keep on watching. It is kind of interesting if I'm going to say so myself. So I have pulled out random.org and we are going to generate from 1 to 12. That is just because there's 12 shadows in this palette. So I'm going from 1 to 6, from 7 to 12. So that is the order I'm going in. The first number. Nine. So number nine is this shade. It is a goldy, very shimmery shade. It is called uh, Lay All Day. And this is a shadow I'm going to apply with my fingers because it is a more chunky texture, like the blue one. So, exciting. Ooh, it could be cool if I draw some of the yellow shades though. So, next one. Number two, I guess my luck is here, a yellow shade. I would love the other one though. This one right here, and third shade. Number 12. <laughs> I don't like that shade. It is this one. It's like a gray, dark shimmer shade. It is called Ultimate Bronze. It's not a bronze. More taupe, maybe. Let's pick another one. Number five. And that is this blue shade right there. Can you see the texture in that shade? It's not very good. Chunky. I can imagine this is chunky as well, but I haven't played around with that shade that much. Four. Uh, number four is this turquoise blue shade right there. It's called Sea Foam. Let me swatch the colors because I have no idea how I'm going to do this. So these are all shimmers except one shade which is the yellow right there. I have no idea how I'm going to do this. So I think I'm going to take the yellow shade and put that in my crease. Maybe uh, top some of this because this yellow shade is more of a transition that, than anything else. Or maybe I should put the yellow shade and this turquoise shade in the crease because on my hand, it's not that shimmery. Uh, that one. These two. Let's take Beach Life, the light yellow shade, in my crease. And see what happens. As you can see, it is a very, very light yellow. I'm really packing this shade on to make it show up a little. Let us try to put sea foam in my crease as well. Because I'm optimistic. It's just turning green. Well, what did I expect? Yeah, let's take some of Sunshine, the more bright yellow, because I'm not very happy about this. I think I can work better with this than the other things. It would be very basic if I took this and this on the lid, but I just know this wouldn't work on my lower lash line. Maybe as an inner corner. Should I try to make it an inner corner? See, now you can see that I have used sea foam a bit and it is turning kind of chunky as well. Not the best palette. I grabbed the W7 Sparkle Stay. 
and it is called a glitter and shimmer primer so I thought it would be perfect because these shimmers are chunky and I need something to make them stay let's try to just take the gold lay all day on the eyelid and let's try to use this kind of brush otherwise I'm just going to use my fingers well no <laughs> that's not working going in with my finger because there's a lot more product on this one and then I'm taking on my finger ultimate bronze that shade real like that in my outer corner here these shimmers have so much fallout I can feel them on my skin as I'm applying it but I do like it though it is, it's actually pretty let's take the crease brush that we used and with a mixture of beach dive and sunshine then applying a little bit more of lay all day and a little bit more of ultimate bronze in the crease I think I'm going to do my face and then I will be right back to do the rest of my eye and maybe add some glitter or something I have not really decided yet so yeah I will be right back okay I am back I have done the rest of my face put on some eyeliner and mascara and lips so I'm going to finish off the eyes I'm going to take beach life on my lower lash line and I'm also going to take sea foam I'm going to take some of the sparkle stay the glitter glue in my inner corner a little bit to try to stick the blue in there let's see if this works I'm going to take the small brush again I've cleaned it and then going into clear sky I think that's cool isn't it and then I'm going to take seashell which is this light white shade and here in my brow bone because I need more highlight you know That is everything for this video. I really hope you enjoyed. I love this look. This look that I have done today is definitely better than the other ones I have done with this palette before. I actually really like how this turned out. I think the gold eyeliner really tidied everything up and with the peachy orange cold cheeks and this lip i love it if you like my palette bingos please uh, let me know down below because i really really enjoy doing them for you and i'm definitely not finished with my w7 palettes yet i do have a few more i hope you're excited for more palette bingos with w7 i will for sure do my other palettes but i i really really enjoy using these at the moment give this video a thumbs up if you liked it Subscribe down below so you don't miss out on another palette bingo or one of my other videos and click the bell so you know when I upload them and until my next video, please take care. Bye!